Today is Friday, May 25th, and I'm going to be cutting my hair for Locks of Love today, after work around 4, and um, I know that my original date was tomorrow, the 26th, but my weekend got filled up, and last night I made a video of my before because my camera's out in my car, because I had to work today, and it's, I figured I would vent my feelings right now because my mom has always been the one to cut my hair. I've never been to a hair salon for anything, any kind of treatment, shampooing, cutting, trimming, anything. My mom is a cosmetologist and she's always done it. And um, I'm just getting really kind of nervous. It's not that I don't trust the girl who's doing it because I went to high school with her and we were best friends. It's just, it's different when it's not my mom because my mom has been doing it for so long, for 20 years. She's done it my whole life. And it's just, it's weird. But anyways. Um, I'm also very excited to give my hair to someone who would love to have it, and I've told people, I think it would be kind of cool if I knew who got my wig, because I just want to see what they look like with my hair, knowing it's my hair, but, um, that's pretty much, I'm just kind of nervous about getting my hair cut. I haven't had a haircut in three or four years. I've just trimmed it and maintained it and kept it growing for this cause, and for anyone out there, if you do know someone who has natural hair and they just cut it and throw it away, tell them not to do that. If they have 10 inches or more, please donate to this cause. People with alopecia and other diseases that keep them from growing, you know, body hair and regular head hair, they would love your hair. They would love to have hair to bring back their self-confidence if they feel uncomfortable being bald, even though... Being bald is beautiful. There's nothing wrong with that. You can't help what goes on in your body. Um, but yeah, today after four, I'll be cutting it. And like I said last night, I already made my before video. And I'm taking my camera to the hair cuttery today. And I'm going to film it when she's chopping it. And then we're going to cut the camera off because I don't want anyone to see what my hair looks like until it's done. And then I'm going to film the second half of my video, and then I'm going to go home, hopefully upload it, and that's it. It's going to be done and over with. I know I'm making a big deal out of it, but it's been a long time since I've had a haircut, and I'm kind of excited because it's getting hot out, and having this full head of hair right here, when it is 80 degrees and humid, just like now, it's kind of frizzy, it gets annoying, and I'm ready for a change. And it's Memorial Day weekend, so I hope everyone has a great weekend, and I hope you stay safe and watch out for drunk drivers, and don't drive if you drink. Please take a taxi or, you know, have a DD, and I will post my video later.